Dia bikin kopi siu tai lah Pemain lu dan so Ika kaya tu Sayur yang pita Oh ika manu peng Holik peng Kopi peng Teh peng Oh puya wang lah Ayo ipe bandong Siang lu fei fei Shake shake Ipe kopi siu tai lah Pemain lu dan so Ika kaya tu Sayur yang pita Oh ika We're at the The Pepsi Kopi tiam at the Holland Village I chose this place because I come here every once in a while with, with my friends to have a late night snack or just have dinner here. I kind of grew up around like the west side, like Queenstown area, so this is a little bit like where I kind of grew up in, you know. Last time there was a land shop in Holland Village. <laughs> then I would come here uh, in my secondary school days, primary school days, just to play land. Then, you know, um, the Starbucks here. I, was, I used to study, like, you know, when I was in school, I would like study there and then, um, Coffee Bean, yeah man, a lot of, a lot of. Walla Walla is a great spot for local musicians too. You know, Jack and Ray, they play there uh, once in a while. Tape D3A too. This is like my, a place that I grew up in. La. This one is the ribeye steak from the, from the store here. Um, I usually get this because I love steak. Like, you know, the steak in a restaurant and the steak in a co coffee shop is really different. So for a coffee shop steak, I like this, I, I, I like this store quite a lot, yeah. And that's a uh, butter naan with mutton curry uh, from, from that um, pepper castle store over there. Um, that's also like, you know, when you when, when I'm with my friends or, you know, we want to share something, we usually order a naan and a couple of stuff so we can just like all grab a little bit. Yeah, that's Kopi Ping, the legendary. <laughs> Kopi Ping is like, you know, when I need a, a little recharge in the middle of the day and then the weather is like hazy, <laughs> the weather is hot, then I'll get a Kopi Ping, yeah. Uh, good place to bring a girl for a date. Uh. It really depends on what kind of date you're looking at though. If you want to get like some uh, good steak, you could probably take, take the girl to Bedrock. As they, they, they got pretty good meat there. If you want to go traditional and, and, and have fun with it, maybe you could bring the girl to Sui Chun. I've done that before. So, <laughs> Sui Chun is the best place for Tim Sum, man. Yeah, hands down the best in Singapore. <laughs> In uh, 368, in the movie, I play this uh, character called Yo-Yo who is like a Liu Lingling son who kind of runs the coffee shop, you know, orders drinks, takes care of the orders and make sure everything is fine. I don't speak a lot, but I rap. Uh, what happened was, uh, I was doing a musical, right? I was doing a musical show then. Um, Don Richmond was like the music director for that musical. And then you know he told Royston to come watch. Da da da. Royston came to watch. Then uh, he wa Then there was this part where I I, I was rapping in the musical. Just just be a very short one, like one minute thing. So Royston saw that. Then he was like, he told his producer like, who's that guy? Like find out that guy for me. Uh, then he went back. He wrote an an entire role around me. Yeah. Which then then it, the, this role didn't exist before before he saw like what I did. So it was, it was quite a surprising thing. Yeah. I direct the videos myself too, and then to be able to watch uh, somebody of um, Royston's caliber directing a movie and, and learning so much from him is uh, it's very rewarding, you know. Because I, you know, like when, when I'm not filming my scene, I'll be like sitting behind the director, watching like how he directs and then um, what 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 scenes um, like how he reacts to certain situations and how he gets the best from the actors. 